I love creating custom graphics for the checkout page. Why? It increases your conversion rates. So what we're going to do is create a new graphic for send order and keep shopping. And we're gonna use the same techniques we used during our add to cart video tutorial. So if you haven't checked that out, make sure to go do that now. All right, we're gonna draw out our rectangle. And here we have just a normal color rectangle. But we want to use the same layer style that we used to create our logo. And that was in our create logo video tutorial. Make sure that you've watched that first as well if you're not understanding. So we move over to our layer styles menu and we scroll down to locate the layer style that we used when we created our logo. There it is. We click on it, click apply, and now our button has the same layer style as our logo. So that way it matches up perfectly. Now let's not forget, we removed our drop shadow from the layer style for our buttons. So we need to do that again by removing the check from the drop shadow. And we're going to save this as button. And the reason why is because now we'll have a basic template file that we can use every time we need to create new buttons. Now we grab our text tool and we're going to write out keep shopping. Perfect. Click on the green check mark, grab our move tool, and move our graphic into place. All right, that looks good. Now we need to save it for the web so that we can add it to our site. File, save for web, and click OK. And we now have a Keep Shopping image. So now let's create another one for sending our order to Yahoo. Well, send order's okay, but I'm gonna go ahead and put send my order. What you write here is really gonna depend on your customers. Remember, test, test, test. If I haven't said it enough, test, test, test. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and move that one into place, and that looks good. And we're gonna do file, save for the web again, click OK, and save our new Send My Order graphic. Now we're ready to go back into the Yahoo store and add our new custom graphics to the checkout page. Now that we're in Checkout Manager, we click on Visual Customization, click on the tab Checkout Buttons, and we're going to locate the buttons that we want to upload our new custom graphics. For instance, we want to change the Keep Shopping text link that was on our checkout page. So we click on that and click Edit. Now we're going to click Image Button, Browse, locate our button that we created, and click Upload. Perfect. There's our image. Now let's take a look and see how this looks in our cart by clicking Save and Preview. Looking very good, very good. All right, let's go back. We need to add our Send My Order button as well. Click on Send Order, click Edit, Click Image Button, Browse, find the new Send Order graphic that you created, and click Upload. Looks good. Click Save and Preview. Now let's scroll down to see our new Send My Order graphic. Perfect. That really grabs the customer's attention. But remember, test, test, test. Let's click Save. Let's go back into our store manager, publish order settings, publish, and let's take a look at our cart and how it looks. Here's our cart before, and here is our cart after. We see the keep shopping button, 
And we also see the send my order button as well.